Breaking news from NASA. The pictures coming in at this hour. NASA now reporting an unmanned rocket exploding on liftoff from Virginia. These are the pictures as we're on the air tonight. The rocket was supposed to deliver cargo to the International Space Station. And watch here shortly after liftoff, the explosion in the air. It's important to point out that as you're looking at this, this was unmanned. But we do want to bring in ABC's chief global affairs correspondent, Martha Raddatz, tracking this live in Washington. Martha, just unbelievable images. David, this was the first nighttime launch from this NASA base in Virginia, and you could see and feel this explosion for miles. The rocket, loaded with highly volatile fuel as it launched towards space, was in the first stage of flight. Airborne for only seconds before it erupted into an enormous fireball. Across the water from this Wallops Island, Virginia base, families had gathered to watch the nighttime launch, only to see cataclysmic failure. A terrifying Man. scene that shook the earth around them. This rocket was heading to the International Space Station. It was unmanned. NASA says no one was injured in the area. It was carrying about 5,000 pounds of cargo to the space station, the third of eight cargo resupply missions under a contract with a private company called Orbital Sciences Corporation in Virginia. The rocket was supposed to be launched yesterday, but that launch was scrubbed because a boat was inside the range safety zone. So the launch was moved to tonight. The site is being secured. There was classified material on board and an immediate investigation is being done to see what went wrong. David? Martha, thank you.